South Siders don't mind, our car is cubby blue. Because we're in Armour Square today, checking out an Italian place that's been a neighborhood staple since the 80s when Big Frank ran the place. Let's go meet the new owner. Frank? Southside episode, of course, we had to hit up an Italian place. Beautiful, glad to have it. And nowhere better than Franco's, right? That's what I like to hear, absolutely. You guys have been here a while. Been here since 89. Now, have you been with us since 1989? No, I am, I'm not that old. <laughs> um, so my, I am. my father started the business. I took it over, I remodeled it. We uh, gave it a breath of fresh air. He's trying not to insult his parents. You're doing an excellent not insulted, job. because without them, I couldn't have done it. Well, he tries something new, so now you gotta come here. From the remodel, the menu, the branding, Mom. Everything has to be branded. Frank's ideas have made this place flourish. You guys have awards up the wazoo, but my favorite award was best place for a cheap date. I'd rather have someone come in three or four times a week, not three or four times a year. We're here every week. The food is delicious. The service is outstanding. And they took a lot of really old school dishes and kind of put a modern and personal touch on it. Mark a pork chop for me. Give me a chicken jardiniere. We'll do the Vesuvio. The chicken Vesuvio is a great crowd pleaser. Of course, that's what we came in for. Yes. It's a bunch of garlic, some nice fresh peas, roasted potatoes. And you're doing the cooking too. I, I'll show you, I'll, I'll, but I think you're gonna have to do most of it. Oh, so I'm happy I'm, to. You know. You're gonna need a nice hot frying pan and add a bunch of oil in it. We're gonna season that with a lot of salt, pepper, garlic, beautiful. Bit of oregano. Here we go with some oregano. Wouldn't be Italian food without oregano. You gotta it. use a bunch of oregano. It's the first time anyone has ever offered to handle the raw meat for me. Hey now. You grab a pair of tongs, you can flip it. Beautiful. Oh, compliments, touching the raw meat. Like you know what you're doing. I'm just gonna move in here. Yeah, why not? We got some space for you. Now after that, here's the part I want to like to see. You're gonna add a little bit of white wine. All right. Okay, so I'm gonna let you do that. Make sure, you know, nothing flares up today. He already told me to watch my hair before we started filming. So if things go awry, it'll be good for y'all, you people to laugh at me. <laughs> Woo! All right, we're gonna season it a little more again. Thyme, rosemary. Garlic, 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 garlic. Now we're tossing as many peas as you'd like. Take as many potatoes as you like. About four is normal, but if you're a little hungry. I would have dumped this entire tray right on in there. Whatever you feel like it. Now what we do right at the end before we put it in the oven, take a nice healthy spoonful of fresh roasted garlic cloves. Make sure you're not going on a date after this. Frank, are you single? I am not single, no. All right, he's not looking, lady. No. Put it in the oven for about 20 to 25 minutes, let it finish off, and then we're ready to go. That's it? That's it. Now make sure you dip it in all the juice. It's I all the garlic. I won't miss the okay. juice. Right. Don't worry. You have to tell an Italian I, to miss I the just, juice. I just, I have Come to on. make sure you know what's going on. Enjoy. Cheers. Ordi mangiare. There you go. I like the pan fry because you, you get a little bit of the char exactly. from in the pan, yep. but then you get a true oven roasted potato. And the garlic isn't overpowering. No. But you could definitely eat this on a date night. This is not, a, this is not an offensive. You wash it down with some wine and you're okay. If I have to. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to tempt me. In Chicago, where Chicken Vesuvio is such a staple, you always need a good place to go, you feel comfortable, and that's why I think we're Chicago's best. Well, hey, cheers to that. Cheers.